Hey, a book about the 50s. Whoa, what's going on? Huh. What? Am I in the past? Welcome back, Scorpius, to a new year. Let's make the best out of the second semester in order to finish this year strong. I'm Jasmine Arenas with your Scorpion News. On Thursday, February 7th, the Class of 2014 orientation will be held in room N16, so all you juniors make sure you attend. Now here's Angel with your Web of Theory. Have you ever wondered why we get bored? Paying attention in class. Bored. Listening to your friend talk about their day. Bored. Breathing air. Bored. Watching another school's broadcasting videos. Bored. But why does our mind get bored? Well, according to Drago's rule, it might be something like this. Well, right now there's entertainment. Well, I hope. If I were to take away the entertainment, your brain now actually misses that entertainment. And your brain goes into a mini depression. And that is what you know as boredom. Again, this is just a theory and nobody really knows what boredom is. But if this is the case, then maybe this would explain why children don't get as bored easily since they find entertainment almost everywhere. Maybe we should try to imitate their expansion of entertainment so we won't get bored as easily because if you get bored very easily, that could actually lead to depression which you could be trapped in your boredom and now you have no way out. Well, that's it guys. Until the next time, Web of Theories. Thank you, Angel, for your interesting facts about the web. Hey, do you want to? No. Thinking about joining broadcasting? Watch this highlight to get an insight of what our class is about. As studio director here at the broadcasting class, I have to make sure everybody's on task and we're all following the production schedule in order to release the episode on time. Hey. Go back to work. Shut up. You see, everybody respects me. <clears throat> what? Oh, are we on? Oh, oops, yes we are. Hello, I am Anchor for most of the broadcasting videos here at Hesperia. Um, to be anchored to me is very important and exciting. Um, as Anchor, you have to be able to broadcast the information around the school and make sure that your information is correct and that you articulate well and enunciate every word properly so that people understand what you're saying. Hi, I'm here in the studio room and I'm in charge of creating all the anchor graphics and lower thirds that you see in our episodes. I'm also in charge of directing our highlights and basically what I have to do is go get the different information depending on what I highlight. Like what I did for the WW, I had to talk to Miss Rockwell. And at times it can be stressful due to, to the little time we have, but it's a lot of fun. Hey, it's Emmanuel here. And sports is pretty much about memorization. You got to know what's going on with the sports around the school. You got to know the schedules, the times, who they play. And uh, it's pretty tough to get used to because there's many different times and stuff like that. But in the end, it's actually pretty rewarding. Well, my job is to make intro and credit, but not for this specific video because they didn't give me the honor to make this intro and credit. But how we get those special Adobe effects is by using something called Adobe After Effects, which is like Photoshop, but for video. Please get the mic out of the way, sir. We'll fix that in post. Anyways, we also use Adobe Premiere, which is like Windows Movie Maker, except for professionals. We, well, we use that for cutting video, putting audio, and music wherever we want. Like a pajami bedami, we put it in there where we want it, and it comes out bammy wham video. Hi, I'm not gonna tell you my name, but I'm technical director. Basically what I have to do is make sure every camera is charged, and I have to make sure somebody's on the computer editing the videos so it can look cool. That's all. That's all. Hey guys, we're from the Hesperia Broadcasting Department and we want to welcome Hi you guys mom. into our classroom. Make sure that you guys join next year and have an amazing year this year. Join broadcasting! Woo! Woo! Join it now! Broadcasting is an awesome class. If you're thinking about joining, talk to a counselor. Sign up for it. Now here's Evelyn Loretto with your Scorpion Sports.
Hey Scorpions, this is Evan Loretto with your Scorpion Sports and today girls basketball varsity has a game against Oak Hills at 6 p.m. Boys basketball will also be playing against Oak Hills at 7 p.m. and they will both be playing home. Boys soccer varsity will be playing against Oak Hills at 3 p.m. and they'll be playing home. Girls soccer varsity will be playing against Oak Hills at 3 p.m. but they will be away. On February 5th, boys basketball varsity will have a game against Serrano at 7.30 p.m. and they will be away. Girls basketball will also have a game against Serrano at 6 p.m. also being away. Boys soccer varsity will have a game against Serrano at 3 p.m. and they will be playing away. Girls vars varsity soccer will have a game against Serrano at 6 p.m. and they will be playing home. And last but not least, boy wrestling will have a game February 2nd and if they win, they'll move on to the CIS. So good luck to them and that's all for sports. Thank you, Evelyn, for your sports update. Try to be supportive and attend games or events. Speaking of, be sure to go out to Sultana and enjoy an unforgettable talent show Friday, February 8th. Doors open at 6 p.m. February 12th through the 15th, Class of 2014 registration will be held in room A7. Juniors, make sure you choose your classes wisely. That's all for today, Scorpions. Stay on track and don't give up. Until next time, this is Scorpion News. Man, how am I going to get home? Hey, you. Hey, Bean, what's your handle? What? What's your name? Oh, my name's Ulysses, and somehow I got stuck in the past, and I need to go back home. Oh, what? I've been in that situation before. I know just a way to fix it. That's enough reading for me. 